Okay, everyone, welcome back. This is essentially the epilogue scenario to the first part of Invasion from the Unknown. Scenario 13, Face Your Fate. <coughs> what in the world are those creatures doing? I'm not sure. They seem to be laying larvae on the floor of the western quay. My lady, we swear we win a rest until either we have spilled all the blood of those wretched freaks, or our dead bodies are all laying on the floor. We'll fight for you. May the glorious ruins of Hergar be our tomb. Oh, the stench of death and decay that fills this place only intensifies my hunger. Let us make haste and finish this once and for all, so we can have our well-deserved feast. Look, the elvish witch is on the dwarfish capital's keep. Drah! Kill her now! And the elf leader too, and find the filthy fairy of the forests. But remember the warlord's orders. Trap the creature, but she must not come to harm. We need her alive and intact. Attack now! You know what to do! Their final assault begins. Hopefully we'll manage to give Galas and the rest enough time to escape unnoticed. Okay, we need to resist for 12 turns. And I only lose if Anlinda gets defeated. So first of all, I'm going to save the campaign right here. And then we shall see what happens. There's a keep down here. Uh, how many enemies do we have? We've got Iskatep, we've got these guys, um, the drones up this way. Um, over here we've got some berserkers who are very nice level 2 units. And what else can I recall? Any of my previous undead troops so there's definitely a few there who are worth recalling. I'll figure out how many actually. I've got a lot of gold income, so that helps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, eleven or twelve or so. Um, Either way, I can rec afford to recruit some new troops. And I can recruit Dwarvish Elf Zerkers, Walking Corpses, Skeletons or Skeleton Archers. The Elf Zerkers are fun. Um, it would be good to keep some in, in reserve. Oh, and I've got a Flamethrower unit here. i only got one of him. But as usual, I'm going to go for the Skeleton Archers. I don't actually want to over recruit until they come a bit nearer unless I want to actually push to try and kill one of these enemies and if I do I don't know I don't like these I, I dislike these guys so much that I think um, it would make more sense to push south if I do push so okay I'm gonna try that have a stable income seems to be not affected by how many troops I recruit or recall.
not quite got enough gold to recruit all of my units. I'm gonna need to have these. Maybe next turn. Ah, oh, finally! My income seems to actually be decreasing. Alright, but next turn I can re recall the last one and uh, I'll still have spare mojo. Alright, we've got dogs, we've got level 2 units. No, mostly this doesn't look too terrifying now. The empty keep to the south. Maybe ought to be a little bit worrying. bring the spectre down here and I'm going to leave the remaining archers and bone shooters to guard. Maybe this one who I can afford to lose can come with me. Gonna need to hit these blue troops like a ton of bricks. Alright, well the drones have stopped recruiting at least, so that's something. Oh no, it's really hard. Oh. Bone Knights really are very good for a level 2 unit. <coughs> yep. Owned. Now these dogs are around. So I'll need to be a bit careful. And by a bit careful, I mean move all my units fast, forward as fast as possible. What they don't have here is anything other than one invoker and one demoness, anything that's particularly great at taking out the spectre line of units. Ah, oh, almost saved you there. <laughs> 
Now clearly the brown unit really only they're heading straight for for a linear, so maybe I should move out. A useful skill. <laughs> ah, frustrating. You didn't get the kill either. Uh, okay. Who deserves the kill? Ugh. That'll do. Alright, I want Raid's Modern Shadows. Or do I? Yeah, I've got, there are dogs down here. Quite a lot of them, so I need to be, have something to take them out. Other, of course, other than spectres. It's got quite good defense there. Throwing you away on the imp wouldn't be such a bad idea, because it will weaken it quite substantially in any case. Well, that's good so far. <laughs> Jammy. Okay. You shoot the dog. Feels like I've mostly got a handle on this now. Do need to, and you're going to go home and defend. And I think Elenia might want to follow shortly. But for now, this is looking good. Hold out! My troops are getting shredded, but I don't mind. That's actually kind of what's expected at this point. Oh, 
Alright, the leader is right there and I've still got Berserkers alive. But that is a drain attack. So I'll have to approach this carefully. I think probably... Probably I'm going to need to attack you with Undead, because if I don't, you're going to drain. Ah, beautiful. Can you get the kill? Mm, not really. You might be able to, though. Now you... Ah, it's pointless! <laughs> Killing me won't do anything to weaken our forces. We are unstoppable. <sighs> you be a shadow. Alright, now we've got... Now we've got drones, Shaxtal, coming in. So, what's the play? The play is for you to get some healing, start. And everyone else, you berserkers could do with some healing as well. I think only you two frontliners can reach down here. back towards the base. You stay where you are, you stay where you are, and... And the barricades. Okay, that's just an energy shock attack. That wasn't so hard. I don't want them capturing all of my villages. I want to keep some income, so... I'm gonna go over and defend from this side. Um, unfortunately, these um, these slightly tougher level two shark style are just going to absolutely rip through my skeletons. There is really no question of that. Just want to stop them for as long as I can from taking my villages off me. So obviously, I'm someone with my priorities right. At least among all of their other insane abilities, they do not have Skirmisher. Don't think I can now get my troops in position to kill.
Okay, now, question is whether the best strategy is just to push straight up here um, and try and kill everyone as fast as I can with the troops that I've got down here already, or to run back to the base. And honestly, I don't see much disadvantage in just killing everyone. But it's a shame that Anlande can't really get in to do the full damage. You step back one, and then you with so little damage. Pretty well. Okay, you're almost a berserker. You can do some damage to this one and go out with a bang. There is a variant on this strategy, which is for Anlinde to run back to the base and for everyone else to fight. Well, that actually might be the wisest approach. Because no one can reach, but other than you, you can reach. But no one else can reach the road. So, Anlinde, you just run. My tough troops will do what they can. This one can still reach her, but I can block it from up here with the flamethrower. There we go. You get some healing and maybe you'll level. Finally you, just do what you can down here. Come on! Yes! Alright, the level 2 ones are so much nastier that I'm always rejoicing when they're defeated. So I'm going to try and knock off another one. That went well. That's it, that. Maybe I should try and push against this player. Oh, oh look. We've got some enemies coming in over here too. We've got some unaffiliated black enemies. What about down here? Yeah, we've got more. So I'm not going to be able to pull this off indefinitely. And, and oh, also from the top. Okay, going to need to watch out for that. Yeah, no point going out and trying to kill the brown player then. incredible. It's a shame that you're not going to be able to pull it off.
Alright, man down! Or at least man wounded. Or at least dwarf wounded. Impressive that these are actually my less good spectres. Ah, oh, okay. No, I need to block you. And I can't. Not unless I move into the light. And you're uh, not nearly as good in the light. So I'm just going to try and kill you instead. didn't work. Didn't expect it to. But I can make this guy's sacrifice not be in vain. Um, and I think the best way of doing that is moving around to here. Because then hopefully this one will have to kill him. No, they, they could be smart and use this one to, do the, to get the kill and this one to move in to get this kill. I just hope they won't do that. Oh, one thing I can do, one, one thing I can do is um, you can come down and block. And maybe that will be enough. <laughs> nice. You've got quite a nasty ranged attack as well, haven't you? Yeah. Should I abandon this house? Yeah, I think I should. There's more. My spectres and wraiths are getting minced, but they're giving almost as good as they're getting, so that's cool. resistance is like on Shaxthal. Okay, they've not got any special resistances. Um, fire does quite a lot of damage to them though. That's worth knowing. I might try and keep my uh, flamethrower unit alive. Okay, where I'm being pushed the hardest is up here. I do have just about enough troops to push them back, I think. Not a foregone conclusion though. Okay, that's good.
Und... Come on! Oh no. It was not to be. And I think that's you dead, unfortunately. I guess we'll find out. are back in town, as they say. Um, now, what do I need? I need fire troops. I don't think I can recruit them. Mm, some old Zerkers wouldn't be a bad idea. Other than that, I think I probably do best what I'm doing at the moment, which is just recruiting archers. So much gold. I'm even going to showboat a little bit and recall every undead that was ever in the campaign. Okay, that should not cause any problems if I'm trying to defend for another couple of turns. from my villages. Okay, these enemy units are right up in my face now. If I'm going to keep I don't think I'm going to keep the spectre alive, so the wraith needs to run. I'll try and keep the spectre alive, but there's more. More shack style over here. I think I can quite dispose of this last track style in the Southern Assault. Oh, 
All right, northern flank. First things first. There's two rather nasty ranged units here who can decimate the skeletons, so I'm going to need to try and get rid of them. The one good thing about Zephyrs, at least, is that for all of their other qualities, they're not overly tanky. As in, you can hit them with things. Just like that. You're not close enough, but you are. You could get the kill. Fantastic. Alright, now it's you. You're the one who threatens me. Don't want to throw away my bone shooters, but I don't mind throwing away normal archers. Oh, they're so, so poor. Uh, the protector drones have, they've got the steadfast ability, which means that their defenses, are, their resistances are doubled, and they're particularly resistant to pierce anyway. Okay, so I'm not really using the right tools for the job. You might be the right tool for the job. Mm, you, nor you. <laughs> and Lindsay, are you the right tool for the job? I can deal a shit ton of damage. And will you get killed if you... Um, no, probably not. Would kind of like someone else to, to get in there and do some damage first. Maybe you can sacrifice yourself. <laughs> didn't kill you. Okay, interesting. Four hits out of five I need from you. And if you don't get them, everyone will be able to... Oh no, you won't. You won't be able to attack, but everyone else will. Well, let's try it. Okay. That was a bit grim. You go around there. And then you push up to the top. Just try and take these guys out. Dogs, there are dogs. All right, now I'm Lindsay, now. There we go, and you get an after maximum level advancement, which is very appropriate for this scenario, really.
and we've got a Death Baron. Interestingly, Baron is ranked above Knight, apparently, in the uh, hierarchy of dead people, but in the hierarchy of living people, at least in the UK, Baron is a rank in the peerage, whereas a knighthood is not, so the official ranking is the other way around in British terms. Hashtag random British trivia for you. Okay, the shadow can run. The spectre actually can also run, interestingly. Doesn't look like there's anyone around to, to threaten it. And I might as well keep it alive. time to regroup and this amazing flamethrower is still there and there's only two turns left to run on this mission so basically it's about getting rid of this wave I can already use those leadership abilities cool cool coming in. Wow! Okay. You more than deserve that, my friend. Thing, these things can't level up any further. They're pretty brutal enough as it is. Zerka's still sitting pretty. There is... Brown is not really doing that well anymore. don't think Brown will be able to threaten me. So it really is now just a matter of defending. Take a breather, this is the last turn that's going to be remotely... Hmm.
I think I forgot you last turn. Well... There's no one up here. So you can all come back for now. You'll get a level if you kill this dog. That's, I mean, that's just epic, so... I mean, even if it's a suicide mission, and even if you'll get smacked down by annoying impact ranged attack dudes... Uh, actually, now that I say that to myself... <laughs> I'd rather waste this rather experienced bow shooter. There we are, out of gold again. And of course I recruited them in exactly the spot I was going to put Anne Linde so that she could heal. Um, dumbass move that was. Actually, you go back to the... no. You stay there, you're better on the walls than you are in, in houses. Down here everyone is either dead or fled. Okay, is everyone falling back to the rear ramparts now? Or are we going to sally out? No, I think rear ramparts is good. I'd quite like to be able to get rid of some of these very irritating drone units first. Two hits should do it for you. Go. You're yeah, pretty experienced too. You're only level one. Get some, should we get some sneaky leadership in here? You could come out and do some sneaky leadership and then run back, but you can't quite go fast enough.
turn. Time for me to click the end turn button. Almost. Great. Nobody informed me that there was another alternate entrance to this chamber in the west. We ought to seal that somehow. Okay, well that's going to be easier said than done. Do I even have an objective? Resist until the end of turns. Turns are not over. Okay, I'm actually in a position where I could start an offensive against Brown. I could try and rush down here and seal this entrance. I mean, that's what they seem to want me to do. But I don't see any way of doing so, so I guess that's a non-starter. Leadership, my friend. And now you're level two as well. Fantastic. performance. That's for you. Oh, I could have got Anland in there. Ah, there is a strategy. But first, I want to kill you. And the only person who can do that is either you or the Spectre, so Spectre it will have to be. tried. That's more like it. Um, what if I want you to do that? I don't want you to do that. I want you, really, to do that. Don't recruit ghosts annoyingly. They would be handy here. I guess that's probably why you can't recruit them. Still.
Okay. Fight me, fiend. This place shall be your grave. You should do like your friends and run away, little worm. Unless you would prefer me to tear your frail body to pieces and delight in your suffering. Trying to divert my attention is futile. I already know where your friends are. It is all in your weak and permeable mind. Your pointless sacrifice does not fool our master either, and neither will it save the cowards from his wrath. We'll find them all in due time. Not if I can stop you first. Okay, objective now to vanquish the Chaos Warlord. So I'm going to call off the assault in the north and focus everyone on that. There are some demons down here. They don't pose much of a threat to my undead. Um, the Chaos Warlord is pretty tanky, as you can see. Um, so, yeah. Let's bring it on. Are the black units actually dead? Um, all, my, all but one of them are. And this one can serve as fodder for my... Uh, my spectres. You're gonna come with me? You're gonna, yeah. even worth it. But you can only kill one of the units in range this turn, so there's that. Alright, push south everyone.
wasn't so strong. You can't reach him. So I'll put you there. You're not fast enough. And you come also this way, I think. Okay, in comes the Chaos Warlord, and there are some... Yeah, that was predictable. So the black units to the left are only to the south. and it'd be cool if you got that. I think you're probably going to get hammered by this drone first. Can I prevent that from happening? Yeah, I can send you there. Okay, can I finally just kill this guy, please? This guy could do it on his own. attack next turn. You're gonna get flattened. You're so close to a level and you're gonna get killed by this guy. Well maybe he'll go for the maybe he'll go for this for the Spectre instead, who knows? Well what's important is that you all press on. Just gain two health by standing there. Uh, 
so close to a level. It was only delaying, delaying the inevitable, but it was usefully delaying the inevitable. And how are you on full health now? How? Did you just get an after maximum level advancement? Ugh. Ah, oh, you guys make me sick. And you're faster than my spectres. such a beast that I think I'm going to let her come to us. That's cool. What about over here? I think finally all of the black units have been removed from the board. So it's really only Brown, who it must be admitted is kind of annoying. And what happens if I put an archer here? Yeah, good. You can't reach my spectre. The warlord can though, and might. Flamethrower. You're going to sacrifice yourself at this point to take out this drone. Wow, okay. Fire damage is so good against these guys. Okay, that means you're going to get warlorded probably, but we shall see. Berserkers are not going to be great against you. Drain, you have ranged attacks that are arcane, fire, and magical. I'm going to do the old undead suicide. Do with leadership man, but he's too slow. And you regenerate.
What about fire attacks against you? How good are you? How good is that? How good is that? Not good enough. You can try and take out this guy, maybe. Ah, oh, you're going to get owned, though. What about you? It's kind of lol. Okay, you will you'll do this, you'll get a level. That's nice. And then next round you're gonna get obliterated. Okay, um if you're gonna get obliterated by ranged attacks, then you might as well be able to fight back. So you're gonna be a death baron as well. And no, just not worth it. You'll just provide free health for the Warlord. Alright, this isn't looking too terrible. Pretty beat up. Drain attack. That was pretty weak from the Spectre. And I'm running out of units. So you block on Linde from that side, that's good. Alright. Oh, I'm nervous. Okay, so now the frustrating part is that she's gone back over here, where realistically... These guys I've got over here are utterly hopeless against any of these units. But what I really need to do is punch through this guy. Okay, so now... Can you do it? You can do it. I'm just going to save here. All you can do is get yourself blown up by a mechanical Goliath. You though can run in. You can't quite kill the warlord like this, and if you try, you'll probably die. <laughs> Given that you can't get the kill, probably go for the slow. Oops. 
Okay, this is an appropriately epic ending to the campaign. We've got our friend over here on very little health. Fifteen health. How can you two be useful? Well, not really. Finally on Linde. You will never succeed in slaying me with such pitiful weapons and spells. By the power you have bestowed upon me, Uriah, may the spells conferring life to the dead be cancelled now. That's not great. No more undead. You still draw breath? This is an infuriating waste of my time. <sighs> What is this? I am not leaving this world without taking you with me. Do you truly believe it will all be over just like this? Oh, naive of someone like you, a past servant of Django. Death will take us all now. None of that matters anymore. Okay, well there we are. That is the end of Invasion from the Unknown. And that is where this video is going to pause. <laughs>